We don't have no time for no Scooby-Doo solve the mystery business. This is a plain and absolute truth about Michael Jackson. So obviously this is Yeshua coming in, okay? This is Yeshua coming in. And today, I'm going to tell you what really happened, okay? So understand that we all know the obvious, okay? Velma and the rest of you, Freddie Do, whoever the fuck you are, we've all put in the clues, okay? Me and the High Family, we always have, okay? All right? We figured it out. And it's not even a matter of figuring it out. We already know. Obviously, he was carbon successful. Obviously, the color of his skin threatened everybody. And, you know, by the way, he did not bleach his motherfucking skin. And thanks for the brothers that have been telling the truth. No. Actually had a motherfucking skin disease that was uncurable and spread it throughout his body. Okay? So... Since he was very young and successful, and you know, the color of his skin, and he made a lot of really good music at a very young age, and he's just always been a shining star since he was a little baby, since he was a little son. And so, when he was getting into this pop industry and all this other stuff, he noticed that there was other folks, he was different. He was doing something outside of what supposedly a carbon man should be doing. So he should be, so basically they were racist. They were saying, oh, well, he should be in the hip hop community. The hip hop, he should be doing that instead. Be along with maybe, you know, well, did Easy E come on? But you know what I mean, okay? Basically, they, he's got to stick to his own genre. That's what they would say. He's got to stick to his own genre because he's, he's carbon, okay? So he kept being himself kept you know getting into the pop industry because that's what he loved doing he loved you know making pop music because pop 80s music and so what really made motherfuckers the most jealous was when billy jean got released those motherfuckers couldn't handle it and also because you know you know he was sexy i was sexy okay and also because i was really talented with the way i danced it was like nobody else that you can include. Like I said, this is my other incarnation on earth, okay? The many forms, incarnations of a tomb. My brothers do the same too. They they have multiple incarnations on the earth, okay? They just don't, that was just meant to not be told to you because, um, you know, you aren't ready to understand, but now you're ready to understand. So when that got released, and then Thriller got released, the jealousy kept multiplying on Michael Jackson. The jealousy kept multiplying because they're saying, how is this man so successful and he doesn't even need to do much of what he does? And so he kept, they kept getting jealous. They kept getting jealous. Especially, this is when they were plotting, they started their plot. Is when the next song was exposing, it was telling the truth about what, who Africans really were, where they really come from, is Remember the Time by Michael Jackson. They were making a video showing an african queen and an african king in that video and that was enough to prove to the africans who they were and also with his head his 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 outfit he was wearing the armor of horus he was telling people that he was god pay attention to the armor folks and remember the time of what he was wearing and the smoke, all the stuff has symbolism that Africans, that's where they originally come from. And then he was showing African, African woman in the back dancing. All of it was exposing the truth of who carbon men and women were from. And so Hollywood hated it. And so Michael was friends. Like I said, this is my incarnation. I'm also talking about myself, right? This is my incarnation is Michael Jackson. Right? Because this is Yeshua coming in. Madonna was good friends with me. But then she turned against me. She turned against me along with all these other motherfucking celebrities that motherfucking didn't want me to su succeed. And it was because of the color of my skin. And so, this is what happened. The great betrayal started to happen with my incarnation. Really bad shit. This is when these motherfuckers... We're making motherfucking, because let me tell you, 
Hollywood can make a movie. They can make up anything, right? And that's what they're meant for, right? Is they're meant to be Hollywood directors. So they made a movie, right? And they made multiple documents or whatever it was. And that wasn't me. That was just another motherfucking dressed, dressed up as me. You know, one of the clips of saying Michael supposedly holding the baby, that wasn't me. Throwing a fucking, raising the kid out the window, that wasn't me. That was actually another person dressed up. Like I said, they can make, Hollywood is highly impressive, okay? Look at the stuff in Labyrinth, okay? There was a lot of people that they were actually wearing costumes, right? Look at the art in Labyrinth and other movies. They did really impressive ass makeup. So what, so yeah, they did that to me. So they made an imposter of Michael Jackson and talked like me and was exactly like me the entire time throughout these documentaries that they made of me. Yeah, it was all, it was all Hollywood staged. All the stuff about, about Michael molesting kids, it wasn't true. And so they hired um, Paris Hilton's cousins. You see those two little kids? Those are actually the cousins of Paris Hilton, okay? And um, they got other kids to speak out against me, to lie. They paid these kids to lie, to say that I, I was the one, that Michael was the one. So yeah, they were paying fucking kids to lie, saying that I was doing this and that with them when I wasn't. And that also another thing to what it's a big lie is that they said that Michael Jackson had a motherfucking big mansion. It was like a kid's place. No. No. So, and it was fucked up because half of these kids. So, in one of the songs, remember that song? Um, I think it was Man in the Mirror. It was one of these mixes where I had all these kids, okay? But they were just there because, and they got their parents' consent. I was filming a video with them, okay? We were all filming them. And we all, like I said, these were child actresses, actors and actresses. And all these little kids, I had to work with them for the video, okay? And I didn't give a fuck about none of them because they were motherfucking selfish brats. I said, all right, kids, you're just a part of my video. I don't give a fuck about you. All of it was public. And everybody saw it. Everybody that, that helped film my music, produce my music, those are the ones that turned against me and lied and said I did shit to those kids. No. That was made up. That was made up. So... Understand that I worked with kids. Yeah, for my videos I did, but half the time, um, a lot of those kids, I, I didn't even have any business with them. A lot of them say I was around kids all the time. No, I wasn't. What, what, what the fuck makes you think that I, I want to make time around kids? I love kids, don't get me wrong. But the thing is, I didn't have time to fucking make time for brats because there was mostly fucking brats on this planet, and there still is. And it's because of parents that that are fucked in the head. So no, I don't have time for motherfucking brat kids, especially motherfucking doing whatever business that you claimed of what I did, because I did it. But yeah, so understand, all this stuff was built, and we know it's fucked up, as Dave Chappelle said. Michael Jackson is dead, and 